I'm Jeff with Marine Detail Specialists, and I'm just here today on this uh, beautiful 41 American Tug here in LeConnor. And just kind of wanted to talk through a little bit about what the owner was looking for um, when they decided to put Sea Deck on this boat. And uh, so this, uh, you know, beautiful boat. It's got an existing non-skid finish. Uh, the owner previously had some mats down here that they used just to kind of soften the deck up and and also prevent um, dirt and things like that, keep the decks a little bit cleaner. And one of the problems was the deck was kind of slippery underneath, so every time you'd step on one of those mats, it would actually slide a little bit, so it was a bit of a safety hazard. And uh, we had worked for this customer for a while, detailing the boat, maintaining it, cleaning it, and I suggested the sea deck uh, to them. And so we've, I think this has been on for about a year now, and uh, the owners really enjoyed it. And we do a custom template of the boat, so it actually fits the boat perfectly. Some of this hardware, like these ladder mounts, even on a different 41 American tug can be in a little bit different spot. So we actually have a digitizer that we use to do a custom template of the boat. A kit is designed and cut to fit this particular boat. And so all these pieces are cut out of sheet material and then we clean and prep the deck and install it. One of the things that's really a big advantage of Sea Deck is you don't have to actually do any uh, grinding or prep work of the boat. So. In the long run, if somebody wanted to take the boat back to stock, they could. We're not using a heavy um, epoxy or adhesive on the deck that's gonna damage the gel coat when you try and take something up. And that's one of the coolest things I think about Sea Deck is it can go over existing non-skid. You don't have to necessarily modify the boat from its original design. So this got uh, prepped, cleaned, and then installed over the top of the existing non-skid. And like I said, this is about a year ago that we installed this deck. It still looks great. The owner loves it. They have a dog, which people ask us a lot of times, do dog paws damage it? But it'll kind of blend in if that does happen. And the dogs really like it. They like the fact that they have something to kind of grip on. And it gives a lot of confidence to them when they're hopping on and off the boat. You've got a really nice, sure footing. The feel of Sea Deck, because it's kind of got a little bit of a um, softer feel to it. So it's really comfortable to walk around on and you're at your shoes or barefoot. Uh, one of the advantages that we've seen with people is that it actually is a little bit warmer underfoot and here in the Northwest generally it's you know got cooler mornings and cooler evenings and so coming out to the back deck and having it be warm under your feet is, is kind of a nice feature to it. A lot of times people are really attracted to how the Sea Deck can make their boat look like the transformation and it obviously does that. It's a beautiful looking product. You can really quickly for not a lot of money completely change the look of the boat and upgrade it in a way that you never you know maybe thought you could before. The feedback we get from people at boat shows and things like that when we get the the job done for them is how much they enjoy the feel of it like how comfortable it is how good the traction is you know when they're kneeling down and they're getting down into a hatch you know it's comfortable under their knees that's a great bit of feedback we get sea deck is uh, non-porous uh, it's a closed cell foam so water-based products don't absorb in it at all so you know any kind of water uh, red wine, any of that kind of stuff will actually just wash right off of the surface of this. So fish blood, red wine, any of those kind of common things that you have on your boat will wash off of there. If you've got crab pots or things like that, it is a softer product, which is one of the big advantages to it. It doesn't get hot like of other, a lot of other products, but it can be damaged by sharp things. So, you know, like crab pots or things like that, we just recommend that people put down some sort of a mat underneath it to protect the non-skid. The questions that we get a lot of times on Sea Deck is, uh, how easy is it to clean? You know, is it does it get dirty really easily? And to a certain extent, that depends on the color. We can make uh, some recommendations based on our experience on boats here in the Northwest of what colors, you know, you, that will hold up better as far as you know not showing dirt and things like that. But if it does get dirty, it is fairly easy to clean. A lot of things will hose right off of it, and if you start to get a little bit of dirt in the surface, you can use some a little bit lighter duty degreaser and scrub it out with a stiff scrub brush and that'll clean it right up. The way that we price our product, the way we price Sea Deck and our service is by the sheet. Most of the boats that we come out and do are a custom kit for that boat. The hardware on the boat is a lot of times aligned in different places. So even if you have you know, the exact same model and year as uh, your neighbor's boat, their, their boat design and where their hardware falls might be slightly different on their boat. So we still like to do a custom template of each boat so that we get a, a yacht quality finish for everybody. So most of the time we're coming out, we're doing a digital template of the boat. 
and really just depends on how many sheets of material it takes to do the job. It also depends on whether we're doing the template and the install. Most of the jobs that we do, we do do template and install for people. Um, kind of makes the most sense for most customers, but there is an option to do self-install or self-template if people like to do that. But basically it will kind of come down to the price per sheet, comes down to the thickness of the material, and somewhat comes down to the design, but we try and make it a really streamlined, easy to understand pricing model.